Hi friends, I hope you are doing well. I hope you are hanging in there. Uh, I want to tell you today about a book by Henry Cole. It's called One Little Bag. Uh, I absolutely loved this book. I am a huge lover of the earth. I care about our planet tremendously. And obviously Henry Cole does as well. And this book is sort of a love letter to Earth Day and an experience that he had as a child uh, celebrating, I think it was the very, very first Earth Day. And in this book, it starts on the end papers where you get a chance to see how a paper, a little brown paper bag is made, uh, starting with the tree, going to through the process of making it into a bag. And then this kid gets this bag and uses it for lunch, but then reuses it and reuses it and reuses it. And this bag kind of goes on a journey through through his life and it just brings me so much joy to see the power of reusing something, to see the power of just caring about our planet and the love that one can have for this world that we live in. I am so excited to share this book with kids for the rest of my teaching career. Uh, I already shared it with my kids, but if I hadn't, I would, would have been the perfect Earth Day book. Uh, and I think that kids for a long, long time will get a lot, of, a lot of use out of this. Our kids love the planet. Our students want the world to be better. They want to fix the mistakes that we have made and treat this planet with so much more respect. Uh, if you read this book with kids, if you get a chance to share this gorgeous story with them, make sure you read them the author's note at the end. It just gives you some context uh, about how the story came to be and Henry's own journey with a brown paper bag. Uh, the author's note blew my mind. Uh, just how many times he used a brown paper bag for lunch, Just I just could hardly process it. Uh, but it's a beautiful story. It's a wonderful story. I think it's like, the give, or not the giver, the giving tree, but not like in such a, I don't know. I feel like the giving tree is like, that kid in the giving tree is like a terrible person and just ask, 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 and ask for more and more and more and it's never enough. Um, but this is like a book about using something and caring about the earth over and over and over again, but there's no like, I don't know, bad guy. So if you're looking for an amazing, amazing picture book to celebrate the earth, to celebrate the world, to give you a little bit of normalcy in your life right now, I highly recommend that you add one little bag to your to-read list. You will not regret it. I promise.